Hi guys, it's me, Rocco Lee. And today I'm going to be talking about the Spirit Halloween movie. Not Escape the Spirit or Spirit vs. Mars. That's. They're still in production. But. Um. Spirit Halloween is released in the movie by October ish. A couple of my friends, like Pixelated Pumpkin, Jim Hans, Hanzilla, posted like separate pages of the Spirit Halloween movie and Jim Hunt and the Pixelated Pumpkin like discovered the theme of the Spirit Halloween 2021 movie or 2022 although it was setting up in 2021 because it's a new year happy new year everyone by the way but yeah basically there's going to be a Spirit Halloween movie. It's kind of like what you do when a Spirit Halloween opens. You just run inside the store, but you get trapped inside. This is the storyline, by the way. So four kids get trapped inside a Spirit Halloween store, and the animatronics come to life and trap them and try to kill them by an evil spirit. And I'm and my Escape the Spirit, I'm coming up with all sorts of ideas, like what music to put in there. Um, but the themes have a concept of like a fact not well they do have the Halloween factory if you look carefully like you could see Henry Hustle is in there he's on the Halloween factory port Uncle Charlie you could see him Evelyn Leach Man's Possessed Friend which I have no idea where he is but I'm trusting my friends uh Brown Jumping Spider a few skeletons Mr. Howell Cuddles the Clown, two of them. So, yeah. There's basically the animatronics. So, I wonder if, like, the movie is going to be, like, all about costumes when they turn to life. Or, like, actual real animatronics fan-made. I think it would most possibly be, like, animatronics or, like, costumes. Because costumes are just really hard. The Huntress is in there as well. She's right behind, like, where she was in the 2021 season. As for Mr. Howe, you could see him in the, like, um, castle. I keep on wanting to call it castle entrance, but I actually want to do a size comparison after this video. Um, but yeah. It's basically a real Spirit Halloween story that I believe Nate went to, possibly. Or, it's just like an abandoned Toys R Us. <laughs> and, it turned to Spirit Halloween, starting in November, all the way till God knows what. I have no idea. So, I think I could recall some of the characters' names. There's Kate. Oh, boy. But I remember that there's one guy's name. I could remember it off the top of my head, but I don't know which one it is. It's the guy from Back to the Future. He's the scientist, but yeah, he's like the director or something. I wish I could be the director because I'm a massive fan of Spirit Halloween, but I am the director of Escape the Spirit. <laughs> um, so yeah, the animatronics are going to be coming to life. Cuddles, I bet like more animatronics will be scattered throughout the store. Besides the castle and the Halloween factory, you could also see Harriet Hustle, by the way. It's not set up like the original thing at the flagship or anything you go to. But you could see that they might use another theme. So there might be four themes. Well, four and a half. Because the Halloween Factory Archway is scattered throughout the store upon the original Spirit Halloween Halloween Factory assembly line. That's at the far right side of the store. There might be some animatronics there, like in the back theme, if they even use it. There might be Grim, Peekaboo Clown, Limb Ripper, Limbing Zombie Boy, Two Scoops. Probably not Two Scoops, that would be kind of hard to animate. Um, Prowling Jack might be there, you never know. So that's basically it for the animatronics. It's just going to be like a fun move. I'm going to see it. I don't care. Oh, speaking of which, I know why the movie was canceled. 
there was only one prop in there. And that's what made it canceled. But now we have... Oh, and also the Nightcrawler is going to be in that movie. Go check out the Wikipedia page. Or I'll just do a screenshot, like, right now. But yeah. That's basically it for the Spirit Halloween movie um, updates. It's trying to be really fast. I'm because I can edit it and get it out. And as for Hugs the Clown, no Hugs the Clown series today. I have a headache because I got the vaccine yesterday, the third one. So I don't have really time. I just have time to just sit on my couch and edit. Not even get up. I'm pooped. She <laughs> woke up at two o'clock in the morning. But yeah. That's basically it. See you later.